This is a Ford inline six cylinder cylinder head with a manifold and a four inch throttle body. What we're going to be looking at is the uh, direct line of sight into the runners to make the airflow as efficient as possible. You will see in this example with the throttle body horizontal, you can actually see the runner that has been taped off. Um, that's not the active runner being tested, but it uh, gives a demonstration that you can see it with uh, no issue, no restriction. This is a throttle body orientation that is uh, preferable for this situation where the, uh, the runners are horizontal. You want the throttle blade to also be horizontal. Here is a flow test of the uh, throttle body in that position. Uh, you can see that it uh, flows basically 320 CFM. Um, that 4 inch throttle body uh, can flow in excess of 1000 CFM. So it's not a restriction, uh, but we'll see what happens on the next uh, test. Now that the throttle body has been uh, rotated 90 degrees and the blade is uh, vertical, you can now see that that line of sight is gone. Then when we run the uh, flow test again, you'll see that we've uh, actually lost 6 CFM. Now on this cylinder head, that is just under 2% loss, which is uh, significant. On a combination like this where you are chasing 2000 plus horsepower, 2% uh, means a big difference. That can be equivalent to well over 100 horsepower at the same boost pressure. This also applies to just general carbureted style intake manifold as well. Uh, when you have the flowing going you know, to the left and to the right, you want the uh, throttle blade to be in the uh, correct orientation to make sure that distribution uh, is right. I've just used a crusty old throttle body uh, to demonstrate this on a carburetor style manifold, but you can see with the orientation um, in the first example that it does block off the runner entry, the view of it, the line of sight. Once the throttle body is uh, turned around, you can see now that the blade now no longer hinders the line of sight of the entry into that runner um, to go down and feed the other main runners into that cylinder head. This is mainly on inline engines, sixes or fours, uh, but it's very important. Well, I do hope you have uh, found that to be somewhat interesting and informative, and I'll see you on the next one.